In this tutorial, we are going to verify the one-way short verification, also called white beam verification, and the two-way short verification, also called punching short verification. And we are going to calculate the reinforcement required for the footing. The one-way short verification is the critical zone where it is expected that the cracking to occur in the footing on the face of the column or pedestal with an angle of 45 degrees. As mentioned in the previous tutorial, isolated foundation design, the foundation won't be designed with your reinforcement, which means PS is equal to zero. With the dimension of the foundation already defined in the first part of this tutorial, the first thing that we're going to do is calculate the real stress transmitted from the foundation to the ground based on the factor axial load and the area of the footing, giving a result of 1.67 kilopound square feet. The next step is calculate the factor shear load at the section analyzed, resulting in 170.34 kilopounds. Now we calculate lambda, resulting in 1.33, which is greater than 1. We take one. The next step is calculate the shear strength of the concrete, giving a result of 567.42 kilopounds. The last step of this verification is compare that the factor shear force isn't greater than the shear strength of the concrete, and as we can watch, verification passed. The two-way shear verification is based on the idealized critical sections located at a distance of half D, as shown in the picture. The first thing to do is calculate the critical perimeter defined as 4 times C plus D, giving a result of 10.53 feet. Now we calculate the factor shear force produced by the critical sections giving a result of 314.82 kilopounds. The next step is calculate the values of the stress to nominal two-way shear strength of the concrete and take the least. Lambda is a multiplication factor obtained from the table 19.2.4.1. Lambda S is the size multiplication factor calculated with equations 22.5.5.1.3. Beta is the ratio of long to short size of the column or pedestal and alpha is a value that depends on the location of the columns or pedestal in the foundation, as specified in section 22.6.5.3 of the American Concrete Institute 380 standard, and the least is 31.55 kilopounds square feet. Now we calculate the shear strength force for two-way shear verification resulting in 432 kilopounds. The last step of this verification is compare that the factor shear force is greater than the shear strength of the concrete and as you can see the verification passed. Now we proceed to calculate the required reinforce of the foundations starting with the footing. The minimum reinforce area required is 4.84 square inch and the reinforce required by moment is 18.4 square inch. We take the greater. We choose use bars of 7 8 inch. The quantity of bar required is 31 bars of 7 8 inches and the separation between bars is 5 inches. As the foundation is a square foundation, the bars and separation is the same as the other orthogonal direction. With this conclude this tutorial.